Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. It's Walanda. So in today's video, I'm going to show you guys my realistic wash day routine, my current realistic wash day routine for my 4C hair. So I do wash my hair in section. I split it into four huge sections, two at the top, two in the back, split down the middle. When I am sectioning off my hair, I use my fingers because it's just easier and I'm able to be very gentle, well, more gentle than if I was to use a comb. So I go ahead and pre-detangle. I found this is the best way for me to retain length and um, not as many breakage as if I was to go straight into the shower to detangle my hair. That has never, ever 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 worked for me. I always lose clumps of hair in the shower. So I have to do this process and using the right equipment to, or the right products to do this process is very important to me. I will show you guys probably in an updated video when I get the product that I normally use. But currently, because I just moved out here to the UAE, I don't have a re-up of my pre-shampoo that I use. So currently, I'm just using the Camille Rose Spritz. I really love using this spray throughout the week when my hair is in twists, but I realize it has very, very good slip to it. So I've been using it to help detangle my hair. So like I said, I work in sections. It's just better for me. I do have thick, thinnish hair. <laughs> it's confusing. It's my, I'm predominantly 4C, but it's literally everywhere. So the two sections in the back, I do split them up into two more sections to help me detangle. And then my two sections in the front, I split those up into three sections all once again using my fingers to separate and I do use a wide tooth comb in order for me to detangle So I am done with all my twists. They're so juicy and fluffy. This is how much hair I've lost in this detangling process. Keep in mind, I have not touched my hair for a month. If I do end up refreshing, it's only on the perimeters of my head. So I think this amount of hair loss is pretty, pretty good because normally if I go straight into the shower, mm -mm, I would lose way more strands. So now that I'm in the shower, I go ahead and um, separate each section. So the shampoo I've been using for a while now is the Herbal Essence Hello Hydration. And I really love this shampoo because it definitely cleanses my hair really well, especially the fact that I do put products right before I wash my hair and I need all of that cleaned out. I need my scalp cleanse. It doesn't over dry my hair. It cleanses it really well, but still keeps it very bouncy. Y'all, when I tell you I had little, very, very little shedding, in my shower, I was so happy. I will continuously wash my hair in sections and pre-detangle because I could really tell I'm retaining a lot of my hair and it's not as many breakages. All right, now that I am done, I'm gonna go right into conditioning my hair. I did this portion out of the shower because I am going to do a little deep conditioning with this um, conditioner. So I make sure I saturate my hair completely with the conditioner. I'm using the partner conditioner for the Hello Hydration by Herbal Essence. I really love the conditioner. It's not really a deep conditioner, but like I said, as of right now, I'm just using it. It's very convenient for me to use and it, it does the job. It does, for right now, it does the job. So I'm just saturating each section of my hair, twisting it up for me to put it under a cap and 
wait for about an hour for it to really penetrate my strands. So I twist my hair twice. I twist it once in big chunky twists in order for my hair to dry. And once it's completely dry, then I go in with the proper moisturizers and for my hair to last for the month. So I did not record me twisting my hair. If you guys haven't seen how I mini twist my hair, I'll leave that link down below. After I'm done with the twist, I just go in with my scalp oil, which is currently this castor oil in order for my scalp not to be dry and flaky. So yes, this is basically it. After this is completely dry, then I go in with my mini twist. And like I said, I do have a video on that. I will link it down below for you guys. If you guys are liking these type of videos, go ahead and let me know down below. Like, comment, subscribe, do all of that good stuff. And with that being said, I hope you guys are feeling strong in y'all natural hair journey still progressing and i'll see you guys in the next video bye